Good morning and welcome to another episode of Jeremy Munson Outdoors. I just got the four-wheeler loaded up and everything in all my gear in my truck. Tell my voice is a little raspy. I'm just getting over sickness. But hey, it's pretty gonna be a pretty nice day today. It's time to get out, chase after some panfish. The goal this winter, gonna try to get a 10 plus inch bluegill. We'll see if that can happen today or not. We'll, we'll see. Reminder, my goal by the end of ice season is to reach 500 plus subscribers. At the re timing of the recording of this video, I'm still not there, but I'm very close. So, thank you for hitting that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Let's go fishing. All right, we'll see you out on the lake. See you in a little bit. Moon is still out. That looks pretty sweet. All right, we made it out here. Uh, everything's loaded up and ready to go, so we're gonna go get after it, see if we can get some more panfish. We'll see, stay tuned. Demon jig, waxy, first drop. We're kind of just in search mode. You can see there's some fish down there, but I have no idea what they are. So we will see. Hmm, we got, we got some kind of a fight around right now. Definitely got some, uh, got some hot. Ooh, yeah. yeah. Take that, look at that beauty. <laughs> Good start. There we go, finally got one to commit. Feels decent. That's a keeper. That's a pretty nice, pretty nice bluegill there, guys. The reason why I'm talking quiet is because there's people and portables not too far from me. This thing feels decent. Not huge. Little crap eye. It's a little guy. Looked at it for a while. It's a nice size one. I'm the fighter. Is a nice 10, 10 and a half incher. I 
bluegill. Ooh, that's a keeper. That's a keeper. Nice one. <clears throat> A good eight inches. Oh, come on. This fish definitely fired up down there. Just got a bite. Ooh. I wasn't expecting a crappie. See ya. Came off the bottom and smoked it. You know, it's another nice eater size. From the initial. Good eater. Well, it's been a pretty decent morning. My hands are, <laughs> they've been taking a beating, so it's been a little harder to record every fish. I definitely caught a bunch more than what I kept. It's been a nice mixture of bluegills and crappies, no huge bluegills. Some really nice 10 to 11 inch crappies. Uh, I got about an hour of fishing left. So I'm going to go try another area just to, just to check it out before I leave. This is what I've kept so far. It's pretty, pretty darn good meal. to a whole different area. And look at this. <laughs> Another keeper. I didn't want to set my tripod up, so I'll just put it on the hummingbird and we're gonna go from this view. <laughs> Being I'm not gonna fish that much longer anyways. <coughs> comes on flying up. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, I was battling this one for how long trying to get my camera to turn back on because <clears throat> my screen went blank from being inactive. But, uh, here we go. <laughs> oh man, that's a beauty. It's good. I set the rod down. Stretch 
show it a little bit. And then two fish came in. And by golly, I got one. It is much nicer out right now. This is. Sun is shining. Feels halfway warm out. Sun is shining. Feels much warmer out now. now I don't need my gloves. Look at that beauty. <laughs> That's another one for the frying pan. Let's see. I was anywhere from 8 to 10 feet of water just kind of trying to work some weed edge structures usually the guideline is if uh, fish are biting at one depth on that lake they're probably going to be biting at that same depth somewhere else on the lake so I highlight those areas on my map and then just drill holes and try on there you don't know if you don't go find fish is by fishing. So get out there. It's uh, February and this is pretty nice weather for me in February. Can't complain. I'm gonna start packing up here and takes a little bit. Gotta get home and uh, I guess I got some fish to clean now. And I can enjoy the rest of rest of the day with my family. Here's the final harvest of what I got today. Not bad. That's, that's going to be really, really yummy, guys. I absolutely love fan fish. And so does the whole family. My daughters both just love, love, love fish. And it's pretty good because they're picky on a lot of other things. So we'll eat up pretty good this as always thanks for tuning in to jeremy munson outdoors please smash that subscribe button hit that like button share it with your friends we'll just uh continue for that quest on the uh 10 plus inch bluegill i still haven't gotten one but i'm not going to complain because every time i've gone fishing it's been pretty darn good so, thanks for tuning in, Jeremy Munson Outdoors. We'll see you next time. Peace. See ya.